Welcome to Dashtune Studio. In the last video, we covered the process of fixing our character's face using the inpainting generation method. We can use the same process to fix our character's dress and make it more consistent across panels. In this frame, you can see our character in a wedding dress. However, she isn't wearing her wedding veil and the sleeves on her left and right arms are missing. We'll start by selecting the brush tool from the left panel and roughly drawing the sleeves for the character's dress. Next, we'll paint around the character's head and shoulders to add the wedding veil. We'll mask the areas we want to edit, including where the brush tool was applied. Then, we'll review the prompt in the right panel and add any missing information, ensuring we have the character metadata and details about the dress. Finally, we'll click the Generate button. And boom! You can see we now have an amazing image with the veil and sleeves just as we wanted. We'll hit Accept to apply the image to the frame. Let's look at another image. Here, we notice similar issues. The character doesn't have sleeves, her hair is too long, and the wedding veil is missing. Just like before, we'll roughly paint over the image to indicate the sleeves, mask the area we want to edit, draw the wedding veil, and block out the hair in front of her shoulders. We'll review the prompt description to ensure it includes enough information about the three changes we want, then click the Generate button. Once the images are created, you can see that the character is now wearing a wedding veil, has sleeves on her arms, and her hair no longer flows in front of her shoulders. We'll apply one of these images. So, just like fixing the character's face, the in-paint generation method can also be used to fix the character's dress across panels. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons to stay updated with the latest Dash Tune tutorials.